Plaza Reforma 222, and today is the premiere for Birds of Prey, and I want some tickets for the premiere. So join me, and let's see if we can see Margot Robbie and the rest of the cast. And here we are. This is the premiere, but we still don't know what's going on. And we're gonna try and go register. But we have all of this, and then we have a whole bunch of people, and it's getting nuts. So we have the trucks over here with birds of prey. This is in Spanish, so look at that. We got some cool stuff going on. And sorry for the shakiness, but this is gonna be awesome. Buenas noches. Gracias.
today and thank you for coming to see our film and we hope you love it and just have fun just sit back for the next little while you can just have a good time because we had a lot of fun making it and hopefully God. you can see that on screen absolutely thank you guys thank you so so we're so excited for you Okay. We love you. If you like the film, tweet us. Yes. Aussie, Aussie, Aussie. We just came out of Birds of Prey. The movie was freaking awesome. So I'll get home, I'll edit the video, and then I'll give my critique and what I think about the movie. It was awesome. See you guys on the flip side. All right, so this is the next day. I am <clears throat> tired, my throat hurts, but I wanted to make the video so we can upload this video today. Today's Sunday. So my experience, um, it was really cool. I got to, you know, see all the all the stuff. Um, it was funny because we went to the mall first, where the theater is, where the actual movie premiere was going to be at. Whoa! I almost spilled my coffee. And looking at the paper, then I realized, oh shoot, it's not here because it, there was no no carpet, no decorations, no nothing. So that seemed kind of weird. It was off. So we ran from there onto this other place called General Prim and that's where the main thing was and there was a ton of people and you can see that at the beginning of the video at I'm at the mall and then I'm an, I'm walking outside and that's where where this place was going <clears> to <throat> that's where the place was where the carpet is the the pink carpet it's not it wasn't red it was a pink carpet so it was just chaos uh it was not organized as well as uh you would want to but it was just chaotic. It was there was people with uh, tickets, there was people without tickets, there was different uh, like competitions, different events that happened to win the tickets. <clears throat> it was chaos. So finally we get in, and first off there was a lot of YouTubers that just walked by. Um, I I cut it off because they're uh, Hispanic uh, Mexican YouTubers, and really had nothing to do with uh, birds of prey cool cool i'm not hating on them it was just i didn't want to make the video longer with people that <clears throat> were not related to the movie um but very good for them uh it was really cool to see these guys these youtubers this this one young guy uh navi he's, he's super popular and people hate on him i don't know why but he's super popular and he got to walk there so that's that's pretty awesome he's young he's really young he does like funko stuff and a lot of cosplaying <clears throat> really cool kid so a lot of these people walked through and then as you can see the three main birds came out so we had all right so we have uh margot roby we had uh mary elizabeth winstead which is the the chick ramona from scott pilgrim and journey smollett bell which is black canary so margot roby uh, Mary Elizabeth and uh, Journey Smollett. Um, who else came out? I think that's the the main the main three that came out. So what's really cool? Uh, they were giving her piñatas, sombreros. It was just chaos. There was this camera guy that kept fighting with this one guy next to him because he had a Funko, and it was blocking his camera. But I mean, everybody was getting pushed, pushed, pushed. And as soon as 
uh, Margot Robbie came out. It just got crazy. It was just, it was chaos. So then we finished that, and then we looked at the tickets, and it said, oh, the premiere is going to be at 8 p.m. at the other mall. So we're like, oh, crap. So we take off running, which we didn't need to. Once we got to the theater, that was extremely organized. They scanned the ticket. They gave you the, the little the badge that you could see, the little sticker. They gave us little baggies where you, you had to put your cell phone so you could, didn't record. <clears throat> and then we walked in there. And as you can see, we had uh, the cast come out again. They talked. It was cool. Uh, main uh, Warner Brother guy was there. So he was he was there. The guy that designed the popcorn bucket was there. Overall, <clears throat> at the theater, it was really organized. It was really cool. We got to be in a, in a big theater. Uh, and the movie. So the movie... Uh, first off, there is a end credit on the movie, uh, like a little snippet. I don't want to do any spoilers. <clears throat> you don't need to stay for it. it. It doesn't give you any stuff for our next movie. It's just if you're a fan, if you really liked it, you stay, you watch, you you know, you sit there. But it's not necessary, so don't come back and be like, hey, Roland, you told me. No, you don't need to stay. Just giving you a hint. <clears throat> but it's fun. Uh, the movie is very, very action-packed. It's it's action-packed. It's not slow. Uh, it reminds me a lot of the chaos from like Deadpool and Deadpool 2. Uh, because, as you know, Harley Quinn it breaks the fourth wall. So she's talking to us, <clears throat> to the fans, to the viewers. And you can see how... Um, it transitions. There, there's no set like timeline. There's no set story uh, at at some parts where it's just one directional. She just keeps jumping all over the place, which is a reflection of how her mind works. So she's doing some. Oh, but wait a minute. So she goes back, and that's how she's telling the story, and that's how the movie flows, and it just flows because when you feel that it's gonna slow down a little bit. She jumps back, and there's some action. There's some fighting. <clears throat> it's very much a, a a female empowerment movie. I I have nothing against that. The movie was great. So I didn't. I know that like Charlie's Angels was kind of crappy. <clears throat> this is not crappy. This is a very good action-packed fighting scene. You can see Black Canary just kicks butts um harley quinn just she's insane it's it's crazy it's it's really good it's a good story um it, it overall very action-packed very good story uh acting was good soundtrack is amazing camera work was really good the outfits <clears throat> everything everything surrounding that was really cool um incorporation of like hand-drawn cartoons and the film, it was, I I enjoyed it a lot, to, to be honest. Um, I wasn't too excited about it because, you know, Birds of Prey, whatever. But bam, you, they didn't even need to show Joker or Batman. Uh, Bruce comes out, but that's a hyena, and everybody knows that. Um, the hyena was cool. <clears throat> the little girl, uh, Cassandra Kane, she did a good a good job with her paper at, at the beginning you're like kind of mm, that's weird but she did a good job uh renee montoya that her character she did a good job uh huntress was kind of weird <clears throat> but that that's that's her character uh funny the movie was funny she huntress was funny and even though it, it doesn't seem like it was a funny character she was really funny um obviously harley quinn is just hilarious and <clears throat> the whole the whole thing the whole breaking up from that nasty relationship it was it was cool i i laughed a lot it was entertaining it it was chaotic but yeah absolutely go watch it um so i just want to give you a big thanks to my friend pablo he's the one that hooked us up with the tickets <clears throat> uh the warner brother guy he was really cool so, yeah, remember, guy, it's Ruffles, Rufles, not Takis. Um, 
Margot and the whole cast. It was awesome for them to show up at the at the premiere at the theater. They didn't probably need to do that, but that was a really cool cool thing they did. So I just want to give thanks to all of them. <clears throat> Thank you guys for watching. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. Please think about subscribing and support the channel. Um, that's it for today, guys. Thank you very much. Go watch the movie. It was really good. You'll enjoy it. I don't guarantee it, but you will probably enjoy it. Yeah, that's it. Bye-bye.